everyone welcome to my channel if you're new welcome today's video is another sure Christmas um, thrift store haul I did one not too long ago a couple days ago and I was able to get back to the thrift store today and I found about five great items um, I like showing these because it just shows what you can find especially this time of the year I know a lot of moms dads grandparents aunts, uncles are really really on a tight budget you have multiple people to buy for, but you still want your home to look nice. I just like showing examples of what you can find if you really look in these thrift stores. They have such amazing deals. Sometimes they have buy one, get one free stuff. Sometimes they have 50% off, and it's just amazing what you can find. Today, I went to a little more of a pricey thrift store for our area. We have two different kinds. One's run by the hospital, and one's run by something called the ARC, and all the... I, I think like a portion of the um, proceeds go to people with um, mental handicaps like Down syndrome, maybe autism, things like that. And what they do is that money goes to uh, fund their housing, their school, any type of activity they need to do. And even sometimes they employ them at the thrift stores, which is really, really nice to be able to interact with them. So it really makes me happy to donate not donate, but to know my money's going to something that's really, really wonderful. But I was able to find some really amazing items. There's only five here, but I just like showing you as I collect these pieces. So if you're interested in seeing what I was able to find and getting some examples of what maybe you can find, keep watching. But don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on anything we do here. Okay, okay guys, guys, let's get started. The very item I have isn't a, I'm just gonna show this one thing. Um, my sister made this for me. She is a, she loves painting, she loves drawing, and she surprised me with this, and she said she's gonna make me a couple more paintings, but this was for the Christmas year. I absolutely love it, and I had to share it with you. It's just so special. She's so talented, and she made me a Christmas snow globe, and it's got a little teddy bear, it's got a tree, a little house in the background, a bow, snow. I just thought she did such an amazing job, and this is just something so special because nobody else has it and it's a one of a kind. I just thought I'd show you that. And this is gonna get hung up. I have this idea to, obviously not this one, but I have two pictures that are like sayings that I have hanging up and I'm thinking, I saw this idea somewhere online, I don't know where, but wrapping it with gift wrap and putting a bow on it so it looks like you have um, a present hanging up. So I'll show you when I do that. I think that's gonna look really cool hanging up in the house. I just absolutely adored this and I thought that was so special and she said she's gonna make me a couple more for the Christmas season and I'll have this for the rest of my life so I was really happy to show that and I really love that and I appreciated that from her I think it'd be really neat to maybe do a video of her maybe showing me how to paint I think that'd be cool I've never painted before and she paints every day landscapes people animals she does it all and I think that'd be kind of funny to see if I can uh, paint like she does. Um, the next item I found were these little trees. Remember I told you this isn't what I was looking for, but it's very similar just in case I can't find the other one. And these were super inexpensive. This little guy was $2 and this little guy was three. So I got both sets for $5. Um, they were sold as separate pieces. I don't know why, but look how cute they are. And I think they're gonna be really beautiful. Um, at first I thought they were glass, so I was a little nervous picking them up, but they weren't. They are plastic, so they won't break, hopefully, or they'll be less likely to break. Um, and I thought they were really cute, and I think when the light hits them, when I have my lights up and my garland up, it will look really beautiful. And they were like in perfect condition. There was nothing wrong with them, and for $5, I really was thrilled. And they're just really cute, and I was really happy to find them. So that's my first really good find. It's like my first find, but technically it's two pieces, but obviously that goes together. The next thing I found, I'm sorry this is kind of short, but I'm just like so excited to show everybody. And like I said, I'm just gonna show as I get this stuff. Even if they're little short videos, they're still a lot of fun to see. I was so in love with this little guy. He was, what was he? You can see I paid $3 for him. Um, he's a little dirty on here, but I can clean him off with maybe a little water and soap or even Windex. But look at him. He had little eyelashes. He was so cute. Um, I'm not sure what you would put in here. Maybe some candies. You could probably put anything you wanted. 
um, even a little flower or something. I just thought he was so cute and so jolly. And like I said, I really want to start collecting little Santas or big Santas, whatever I find. And I found him and for $3, I couldn't not take him home. And he's a little worn around here, but I love that about him. He looks like someone really loved him at some point. So I was excited to find him and bring him home. So he was so cute. Look at his little rosy cheeks. So I was really excited to find him. So I thought I'd show him. This is the next thing I found. This was literally $5, you can see on the back. Um, I told you in the last video, I really love the um, Christmas carolers. And it's a little family of carolers. It's a clock and it's a church. It does have a place for batteries for both things. I don't know if it works, but even if it doesn't work, I'll just set the time to something or we can change the time and just make it fun. But I thought how beautiful, like if you went to a Christmas shop, we have a Christmas thing called, uh, we have a Christmas store called Winter Woods and everything in there is just almost untouchably expensive. And something like this would probably be maybe $30, maybe 50, I'm not sure, but it's so heavy um, and it's absolutely stunning. I love it. It's got little cherubs, the clock, the family. It's a nice, beautiful um, chapel. I just thought this was absolutely beautiful and it will go perfect with my Christmas carolers because obviously they're little singers too. And it looks like a little boy and a little girl and a mom and dad. And I just thought that was so cute. Um, I'm just really excited to collect all these pieces. I never was really big into Christmas growing up. It was never really like a holiday that I really appreciated until I got a little bit older and decorating. It just is something that I'm so excited for this memories for the memories for my kids to be like, you know, my mom decorated and everything looks so nice. And you know, I don't mind that these are secondhand. They look just practically brand new and I love them. So I was really, really excited to find this and I couldn't believe it was only $5. Everything here I got for $19 even. So this was the fourth thing I found and I have one more thing to show you. And I really, really love this one too. I really love everything to be honest. I can't really, couldn't even begin to pick what my favorite was. They had so much stuff there that I wanted, but I try to set like a budget for the week because I could spend a hundred dollars in the thrift store if I really wanted to. So I try to just, you know, go in with, I take cash with me that way. I don't use my card. Some places you can't use your card in the thrift stores, but ours they allow for whatever reason. But I take $20 with me. That's what my budget was for today. Sometimes if I have a little more then that's what I'll spend. Sometimes I have a little less to spend. Um, but I think this is a great deal for 20 bucks. This is a, and I have a dollar to spare for next time. <clears throat> but this was the next item. Like I told you, I'm really excited to be collecting little Sannies. And he was only, he was $6. I don't know if you can see that. Um, he's got a heavy bottom. So he must be weighted. So he sits like this, I guess. And that's how I saw him. And I literally picked him up. I think I picked him up five times and put him back. And the lady... I was ringing up just the four items that I had and the lady said, I said to her, hold on one second, I really want that Santa Claus. And she's like, I saw you pick him up four or five times. I was like, I know, and I didn't know if I wanted him because it was between him and they had a lantern there, a Christmas lantern, and it was $10. And I think if it's still there on Monday, I might grab it for 10 bucks because the lantern at Walmart that I want, it's a red lantern and it's $20. But if I can get this one for, if it's still there Monday, then it's fate and I'm gonna buy it for 10 bucks but I picked him instead and I really thought he was cute and really unique. I've never really seen anything. His hair is just made out of yarn and he has his little red cap and his little green pants and his little boots. And he has a little, um, just like a Christmas basket or, or a Christmas um, like burlap sack bag. And I thought he was really cute. So I think he'll sit nice with all my little Santas, so. He's not in the, you know, he's not brand new by any means. I mean, his little coat's a little fuzzy, but he looks like someone really loved him at some point and he's gonna keep being loved by us. It's a really nicely made Santa. I mean, it must be, it's a doll under here. So I was really excited to find him and he has a little bit of, um, like I said, is he's weighted at the bottom. So he's gonna look really cute sitting somewhere, maybe on top of, my uh, china closet or my bookshelf just sitting with his little legs dangling so i thought he was really cute so i was really excited to find all these things um i was really excited about everything i found before too i've had a really good luck at these thrift stores and i'm going to keep going back and just checking things and just add to this 
you know my collection of Christmas stuff and I'm gonna have a lot more to store this year or after the holidays I'm gonna have to get some bins to store more stuff um, I do have a lot of nice little things like I said I have a manger I also have a huge snow globe I have quite a little um, array of little trinkets um, but this stuff is really special to me and I think it's gonna be special and it will last for years and years and I can give it to people you know my kids when they get older if I wanted to or pass it down so I was really excited to find these items and they're in such good condition so I really hope you enjoyed this um, if you have any questions feel free to leave it down below I hope you subscribe and thank you so much for watching guys bye